But it is a day that many have been waiting for. After more than a week of waiting to follow CDC guidance on indoor masking, Governor Murphy announcing today that that indoor mask mandate will be gone Friday, but there are some exceptions. News 12 New Jersey's Alex Dan in Trenton with the latest for us this evening. Alex. Governor Murphy becoming the 49th governor in the United States to announce how and when the indoor mask mandate, which has been in place here since April of 2020, will be lifted. The governor making that anticipated announcement at his COVID-19 briefing. It's the latest reopening leap made by the Murphy administration, and it comes just in time for Memorial Day weekend. Here's what you need to know. This is what's happening effective Friday. That indoor mask mandate is gone, whether you're vaccinated or not. You do not have to wear a mask indoors unless a business requires you to. Business owners still can require their customers to wear masks. Also Friday, and this might be even more significant in the long term, the six feet of social distancing that you had to maintain since forever, that's gone. That means restaurants don't need to space out tables anymore and can take advantage of that eliminated capacity requirement, essentially meaning 100% indoor dining. And in case you're interested, dance floors are also reopening and bars can serve drinks without social distancing if you're standing at the bar. Governor Murphy saying you won't need to show any proof of vaccination to go without a mask. We won't have law enforcement checking people's vaccination status, but we are asking people to be responsible and to do the right thing for your own safety and the safety of your community. To be sure, if you feel more comfortable wearing your face mask when shopping or waiting for your table at a restaurant, by all means, you may continue to do so. No one should mistake lifting the indoor mask mandate as meaning you cannot wear a mask indoors. You certainly may. There is nothing wrong with being cautious when it comes to your own health and that of your family and community. Like many of these other executive orders, there are exceptions. This does not change the masking requirements inside schools, inside daycares, and at summer camps going forward. The summer, the Commissioner of Health saying that only about 12% of kids ages 12 to 15 years old are vaccinated, and that's, that's a part of their decision making there. Masks also still required to be worn inside healthcare facilities like nursing homes, also inside state buildings that have public access like the Motor Vehicle Commission. And if your employer chooses, he or she can make their own mask requirement inside your place of work. Now, as far as those who are not vaccinated, Governor Murphy saying, please go get vaccinated. And if you want to, you can go without a mask. But the governor strongly, strongly urging people who are not yet vaccinated to wear masks indoors. In Trenton, Alex Adair, News 12, New Jersey. 49th in the nation. Alex, thanks a lot.